to another Excel chat walkthrough video. I'm your host, Kevin Kelly, and today we are going to talk about how to calculate a tax rate using VLOOKUP. So this is a fun video, um, especially if tax season is coming around. But this is basically just a video to show VLOOKUP's functionalities, and in this case, we're using a tax example. So uh, in this case, we have uh, in column A, taxable income, and in column B, your tax rate based on your income. So for this example, we're going to say, okay, uh, we have a salary or an income of 100 grand. Okay. And the way that we're going to go about doing this is here under the rate, we need to figure out, okay, um, based on the taxable income and the tax rate and based on our income, what is our tax rate? So if you have a massive column with a ton of data and the tax rates go on and on and on, or the incomes are very um, separated, like five, seven, 10, and on and on, um, this was a really great tool. And we're going to show you its functionality here. So equals the lookup parentheses. So it's asking for the lookup value. So our lookup value is income. So that's what we're looking up. That's what we're comparing it to in these other uh, columns. And now we're going to hit a uh, comma. And now it's asking for the table array. So it's asking for our range basically. And then we're going to go here and select all of this because we need to find out our 100,000 within taxable income. What is the associated tax rate? And then with that, we're going to hit comma and go to because we're looking here, column number two is the column that we want basically displayed here. So the tax rate, which is column number two, that's the value that's gonna be displayed here. And then we're gonna hit comma and then put true, which is approximate match. There's no exact match because our 100,000 doesn't equal any of the taxable incomes, but it's in between a certain range, which is what we're going for. So now we're gonna hit parentheses and then enter. So as you can see, um, with our $100,000 income, it gave us a tax rate of 22%, which is in between 82 and 158,000. So yes, that makes sense. And obviously you can look at that yourself and it's pretty easy to tell, but when you have more data um, and less time, this is a really good tool to use. Um, now for the tax rate uh, and for how much basically you'll be paying in tax, super simple calculation. You do the tax rate that you found times your income, uh, which is 82. And that's going to give you $22,000. So your tax on $100,000 is $22,000 off of a rate of 22% that we found using VLOOKUP. Like I said, short, simple video, but very, very informative and a great way to use VLOOKUP um, among the variety of ways that you can use it. Still have questions? Click to get help from a live Excel expert at Excel Chat.